This week I'm doing a couple of continuing education courses. One is around a reset in myself and my leadership, and the other is on the Enneagram. In one video previously, I mentioned the Enneagram, and I don't have space or time to devote to a totality of covering what the Enneagram is, but we'll say that it is a way of understanding who we truly are, yet it is more than just a personality test or inventory. In the training this week, Claire, our trainer, pulled out a quote from the late Christian writer and thinker Henry Nouwen. In his book, Making All Things New, he writes, One way to express the spiritual crisis of our time is to say that most of us have an address but cannot be found there. This came in response to having to know ourselves before God can fully use us. And we have to know God before we can fully know ourselves. The life of faith is circular in motion. I'm intrigued with this idea of an address though. Where is it that we live? Especially as this new year has started, where is it that we find ourselves? What if we have an address, but we aren't physically found there? Sure, you can be at different places and with different people, but what if we don't recognize ourselves where we are? Can we find ourselves again without getting lost? I think the answer is yes, and I think that's what God is all about having us to do, to find ourselves, to discover what more God is calling us to be. And that requires knowing ourselves. Perhaps that can be our goal in 2023, to know ourselves and then discover what more God has in store for us. This is your moment of peace with me, Pastor Travis Wilson. Blessings on your week.